Loki's executive producer has an absolutely hilarious meltdown in response to Martin Scorsese absolutely torching the Marvel model, which, as we have begun to see over the past few years, is not a sustainable model. It is an absolute model of trash and garbage because that is what we continue to get from Marvel these days. It is not about actually telling good stories anymore. It is not about actually giving us good characters and characters that we can actually relate to. It has nothing to do with that. It is all about diversity quotas and checkboxes, and that has been made very apparent in a lot of Marvel's recent offerings. So Loki executive uh, producer fires back at Mark Scorsese's criticism that comic book movies pose a threat to culture. Which is a very interesting thing for Martin Scorsese to say, and once we look into it, what he actually has to say here, you will see that there is definitely some truth to that. In pushing back against Martin Scorsese's uh, recent criticism that the Marvel Cinematic Universe's manufactured output is actively degrading human American culture, Loki executive producer Kevin Wright has offered up the Disney Plus series <laughs> as proof talking about Loki, just keep that in mind, that the franchise is capable of producing something truly cinematic. Now, I can tell you one thing. I, did, I highly doubt that anyone watching this video would ever stoop to that level of claiming that Loki is cinematic. I know that I wouldn't. The danger there is what it's, do what it's doing to our culture because there are going to be generations now that think movies are only those. That's what movies are, talking about Marvel films. And it's got to come from the grassroots level. It's got to come from the filmmakers themselves. And you'll have, you know, the Safdie brothers and you'll have Chris Nolan, you know what I mean? And hit him from all sides. Hit him from all sides and don't give up. And we're going to be watching the video here of the response, the hilarious response from Kevin Wright in response to Martin Scorsese, but Martin Scorsese continues on by saying it's almost like AI making a film, which is exactly what I've been saying about Ant-Man 3 and so many of the other Marvel offerings of late. I think with Loki, we wanted to build a really, uh, <laughs> we just wanted to make a great story and a great show. And Right, right. That's all that you wanted to do. There was no agenda whatsoever, despite the fact that the writer of Loki literally said that her main goal was to make Loki bisexual. It's being built with a lot of love and care and a and an eye for the the cinematic. Uh, an eye for the cinematic. Loki. An eye for the cinematic. Loki. <laughs> um, so, you know, I think any of these shows, any of these movies, anything in this world is is they're about making a character focused story that audiences can connect with. Uh, sometimes we succeed at that. Sometimes we don't. Do you connect to the Loki show? I, that, that's a genuine question that I have for you watching this video. But, um... And it's funny that he actually admitted here that they have completely botched it and failed. I, I think something like this show, I would challenge anyone watching to say that it's, it's not cinematic and it's not built with... Challenge accepted, Kevin Wright. Uh, it's, it's not cinematic. Uh, it's just, it's just not, okay? Because, frankly, people just want to see good stories. Yes. Yes, people want to see good stories, which is why Loki is not succeeding at that, okay? You can look at the numbers. The numbers show that you are not succeeding at that. Um, so anyway, and just keep in mind that, that there are people that worked on, like, even the She-Hulk show for Marvel... Let's say that that is a great story. It's a great story, everyone, and we, we did such a great job with making characters that you can relate to and connect with. BS. Nothing could be further from the truth. Martin Scorsese is completely spot on with what he says here. Anyway, let me know what you think about this in the comments below. What do you think about what Kevin Ray has to say in response to Martin Scorsese? It's absolutely hilarious. Hope you guys enjoy. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll talk to you all in another video very soon.